Welcome back folks, my name's Anthony Valentine the Camper Nerd, this is my first video of 2023 believe it or not, hopefully the microphone's going to uh, hold up, we've got a bit of wind today, um, yeah I've been very busy the last couple of months supplying my regular customers and subscribers with camper vans, uh, just getting slightly on top of the job now, we've had a delay in getting parts and vehicles getting processed but we're getting back on track now so I'll have plenty more videos and campers for you to show you over the forthcoming months. Okay, let's start with a cracker, 2023, with a great one. One of my favourites, it's an auto sleeper, it's the Executive. This one's a 97 model, so that makes it 25 years young. This is just lovely, it really is. Just two owners in the 25 years. The first owner had it for 15 years, the last owner has had it for the last 10 years. Um, the last owner, unfortunately, only a couple of months ago, uh, it was over in December, they had a problem with the waterworks in the head gasket area. Anyway, they drove on and they had to be recovered. So a long story short, two months ago in January 2023, I've got the bill there for £2,600, a whole new exchange head, head gaskets, all the pulleys, uh, heater plugs, um, some water hoses, a flush and a service. So that's just being carried out. It's also got an MOT until January 2024. Not a single advisory. Feel free to check up the MOT history online. Romeo 550 Alpha Mike Alpha. And that'll give you the past MOT history. It's wonderful. Just silly little things. A wheel bearing here, a pair of wiper blades here and there. But nothing really detrimental. A couple of brake pipes have been corroded in the past. But obviously they have been done now. Because it's advisory free. Okay, let's walk you around. There's even a new set of Michelin tyres. Four Michelin tyres. Um, all sport. I think it says uh, all winter. So yeah, Michelin tyres all the way around it. So on the passenger side, you've got the large... Fiorma F45 awning. I'll show you that out on the pictures. You've got the cupboard here for the LPG gas tank. Uh, there's one six kilogram propane bottle supplied, uh, but you've got room for a second one if you so wish. On both sides, you've got exterior slide out cupboards for any accessories you so wish to carry. Fridge vents. That just clips out that can actually add as an extra security so there's a locking mechanism here you can pull that and put that over the leisure door if you wanted extra security or of course you can use it to climb in with the step just a nice little feature coming around to the back we've got the two bike fiorma rack here we've got a few accessories inside uh, the reversing or the reverse stabilizers if you're on an uneven area yeah it's in lovely condition this rear steps you've got the two taps here for the water so one will be fresh water and one will be the wastewater tank you've got the standard fetford cassette for your toilet and you've got um, a flush facility in there so you've got the top one that you'll be putting pink pink for the stink as the caravan is rhymed for the flush and blue in the loo uh, mains hook up, I've got it plugged in here so I can show you the fridge working. Carver Cascade, so that will be heating your hot water on gas if you're wild camping or electric if you're on mains hook up and everything is working, I'm glad to report. This is going to be on auction with no reserve. Make no mistake, it will be on sale with no reserve. I'm that confident of it, I will deliver it free of charge to the winning bidder anywhere in the United Kingdom by myself. If for any reason you're dissatisfied, I'll bring it back. But it's never happened before. And providing everything's fine, I'll get the train back. So as I say, a free delivery nationwide is included in the price of the winning bid. I'll take you inside shortly. We'll just pop the bonnet. It has got the power steering. So it's a 2.5, it even adds a new turbo intercooler or something. It's up there on the invoice. I'll be doing lots of photographs of the invoices. Fingers and thumbs, I've not done a video all year. There we go. So it's a 2.5 Peugeot turbo diesel. Yeah, she's in very good condition all the way round. Um, 
not much more to say really it drives well i've driven this a couple of hundred miles as i say it's got the power steering five speed gearbox no clunches or anything i've just noticed that we've got an aerial broken here so i'll see if i can get your new aerial fitted there ah it's only a small one it's not an aerial broken it's actually just a small stubby one so we'll have a little fly round of the roof show you the drone and uh, then i'll take over the camera and take you inside so over to you drone Thanks for that, Dennis the drone. Okay, stepping inside. I did tell you she was nice. This is just lovely. Look at that upholstery. Not a single mark. Beautiful. And this is the four berth configuration. So you've got the double bed above there. You've got some extra filling cushions here. So what happens, this will, as you can see also too, side opposing lap belts on the side opposing sofas so this the two sofas pull together and make a large width way double bed so you can sleep that way or both the front seats can pull forward this one will lift up flop forward into place and then you can use those extra filling cushions to make a mammoth queen size bed one of the largest beds that you could ever get on a motorhome also, there's the folding metal steps that hook into here. So the children will be excited to be sleeping up there and you've got a safety net with hooks if you so desire. Um, however, if you don't wish to have the double bed configuration, this here lifts up, slides forward, and then you can have a cupboard and it's an auto sleeper again, cupboard that goes across here and catches into one catch there, two catches there, and at the bottom. Uh, I have got it outside, so I'll just show you now what I mean. It's easier to show you than explain. And that will just, that's the one. And that will just sit into place. And then that will give you the extra headroom here if there's only two of you going away. So then you can use that as a cupboard, or of course you can use that as the space. But yeah, this is just fantastic. I've personally checked everything is working. So you've got the fridge, it's the three-way fridge, so it's working on 12 volts as you're driving, mains as well as gas. If you're uh, wild camping, you just turn that down, over, hold it in for a few seconds. That stopped flashing, so that means it's ignited. You let that go, you hold that in for about three or four or five seconds, and that just purges a bit difficult don't we? you can see the pile of light from there and that just purges the uh, air from the system so we'll just switch that off now the very straightforward auto sleeper control panel water on and leisure on leisure battery's been tested and that's perfectly fine as well yeah the interior is good there's no marks or smells the only thing that uh, i'm fussy I'm well renowned for changing the buttons and bezels. They were just showing the were after 25 years, so I've replaced all the buttons and bezels all the way around. Wardrobe, wet room. If memory serves me correctly, it has even got the, <laughs> yes, look at that. It's even got the original auto sleeper crockery. That's 25 years old and everything's the no breakages whatsoever this has been looked after as i say the first owner had it for 15 years and the second for 10 years and everything typical auto sleep look at that woodwork just everything is just click clunk into place
all the lights work on 12 volts so that's if you're wild camping but obviously if you're also plugged in the mains will charge the battery and then that will drop it down to 12 volts however all auto sleepers have a mains light only so this is the one so that will only work if you're onto mains so there's the carver cascade so that's for the heating the hot water on gas and you just switch that on there um, you've got the carver heater and that lights on gas or electric and again I've had that tested wardrobe oh they've even left you a, an umbrella and you can heat the hot water on electric or gas or both at the same time if you're in a rush you've got two table legs and two you've got a large table so two positions here you can have both tables up at the same time or the small one or the large one or vice versa um, and they both click into place behind it's actually behind the driver's seat i've actually just got the large one outside to show you three standing because that comes with a tripod okay yep lots of cupboards i've changed all the buttons and bezels as i've shown you the all important one oh it's got the wine flutes as well as some, a pair of uh, sherry glasses blackout blinds and fly nets to all the windows i've damp tested it and typical auto sleeper there's no leaks with the famous monocoque one piece fiberglass body tricky to show you the cooker we're holding the camera up but I'll do my best but no it's been uh, well kept this As you can see it's all nice and clean I don't know whether I'll be able to get one working to show you oh yes I can there you go everything's working as it should do so in the next couple of days it's booked in so before the auction end it's booked in for a full habitation service and then with the completion of that as i say I, i've tested everything is working but i'm not qualified with the electrics and the gas so once the caravan engineer has been completed a service he will issue it with a new habitation certificate so it'll have a new habitation certificate for the new owner hot and cold running water drainer board under sink storage grill okay that's all been tested all nice and clean again I don't know if I can show you the oven working with the oh yes I can there you go under 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 oven storage uh, there's a few main sockets main socket there there's one at the front one here as well as a 12 volt so that's a 12 volt supply off your leisure battery for charging up your gadgets and phones etc there's an override here for your lights if you didn't want to reach up above and uh, and here is your tv hurdle just lastly show you inside the wet room again in nice condition all the way around it's all been sanitized hot and cold water again and shower facility no everything's as it should be it's even got a pair of the original matching scatter cushions to match the original curtains. Uh, the last owner had a joystick, I don't know what you call them now, uh, on the steering wheel, very easy to remove. So if you want to use that, or I can remove that before delivery. Five speed manual. Here's the paperwork. Now, the only paperwork I've got is from the last owner. So there's a, a massive paperwork trail for the last 10 years, but not from the first owner who had it for 15 years. 
I'm, I've got the name and address of the first owner, so I'm going to try and find out. So feel free to uh, email me or contact me on 0798 526 1078 and I will try and get to the bottom of the, the service history for the first 15 years. As I say, there's rafts and rafts of service history from the first, but there's the invoice for £2,690, was it? Two hundred Yeah, £2,694. And that was just carried out in January 2023. And there's a certificate of the new MOT. very conclusive rafts of MOT and service history for the last 10 years of ownership. Okay, so stepping back outside, I'll just have a recap. So here's the table, it's got a leg and it's got the tripod, so obviously the large table or the small table you can use outside. So it's a 1997 Auto Sleeper Executive. It's the four berth version. MOT'd until January 2024. I'm that confident of this. I will include a three months warranty as well. So I'm going to include three months warranty, a free delivery anywhere in the United Kingdom. My name is Anthony Valentine, the Camper Nerd. You can contact me by text, email, phone call or WhatsApp on 0798 526 1078. As you can see, I'm well uh, known for my love of auto sleepers. Another one there. There's a legend just arrived in stock. There's a talisman just arrived. An old that one's coming up shortly. That's a lovely old T25 auto sleeper. That's 30 years old. Uh, another trooper that's just arrived. Not much more to say. So I'll catch you on that next video. And any questions, feel free to ring me on 0798 526 1078. I will not be ending the auction early. It will carry on, I'll stick to my word, it will carry on to the last winning bidder. And as I say, the winning bidder is entitled to a three UK delivery anywhere in the United Kingdom. All I ask is for a 500 pound deposit and then I will deliver it to you and show you around. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on that next video.